So today I just wanted to share with you something that I had gotten to work on a few days ago and as I call this custom creation the Lego Antique Shop. One of the reasons I decided to make this custom creation is because I thought this would be a, a very, you know, uh, unique idea and as well as because I need more buildings for the city. Why are there so many planes in my neighborhood? Where's that plane even? Anyways, uh, sorry about that. The reason I had selected a trans transparent front entrance door is because, you know, I, I just thought it would um, look very nice and, uh, you know, I just thought it would fit in. I had added in um, two windows on the side here for realism and uh, as well to let in a lot of natural sunlight and as well, you know, to let in fresh air. I had added in this art because, you know, I, I just thought it would um, fit in with the theme of an antique shop and as well as I had added in this 60 year sign because I, I thought it would uh, be cool. This came with the Mission to Mars Lego box. And over here I had added in the uh, Rocket Man as, as I like to call because I um, again thought it would be pretty funny and uh, pretty unique. At the front of the building I have decided to make you know a bit of a uh, pattern uh, the white aqua red aqua and the red because I, I just thought it would bring a lot more life to the building on the side of the building work is still being done as you see i have made a pattern of the the blue yellow and red and at the moment i am still thinking to have a lot more red yellow blocks to continue finishing off this layer then after that I will be deciding of which color I do decide to uh, use next so um, you guys can let me know in the comments below of which layer you would like me to use or uh, again just uh, more improvements I have added in a back door so in case of an emergency if shoppers are not able to to exit through the front door they can uh, exit out through the back door and uh, Here's a, just a, another window, you know, to let in sunlight and uh, as well let in fresh air. I'm not entirely focused on the interior. I will uh, show you guys around the, uh, give you guys a full on tour when the building is complete. The only really thing I am focused on is about making it the correct height so it can fit in, you know, um, objects in the store, uh, items I should say, such as this uh, pirate boat, so I, I might have to make the the walls a, a bit higher, so again, it will, be, it, will, it will be able to fit in the, fit in certain items. And that pretty much is it for today, guys. Hope you guys very much enjoyed this video, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to let you know on for today. Let me know in the comments below of what you guys, you know, think could improve and uh, yeah, that's uh, again pretty much it. I am still going to be working on making the walls higher so it can uh, fit in some objects in the item shop. Uh, nothing else to, much to say apart from uh, thank you guys very much for watching this video. Uh, I hope you guys, um, hope it keeps you guys up to date about what I've uh, been working on. The, yeah. Thank you guys again very much for watching this video and I will be catching you in the next one.